How's it going fabulous TAs? In this video, I'm going to share with you three great EAL resources that will help you support a child with EAL. Hello there and welcome back to TA in Control. My name is Lauren Reisner and here I give you the tools and resources to be a teaching assistant working at your most confident best. And as I said, in this video, I'm going to share with you three great EAL resources that will help you support a child with EAL. So let's dive right in. Many of the books about EAL available to TAs and teachers include quite complex information written by academics who may or may not work in the classroom making their information tricky to put into action. I have created this video, my free resource and my EAL workbook to enable teaching assistants to engage with the subject of English as an additional language without feeling like it's a mountain to climb. If you are daunted by the prospect of supporting a child with EAL, make sure you watch until the end of this video so you don't miss out on my free resource that will help you with this further. As a TA, you are in the trenches, meaning that you have little time to read complex research-driven textbooks. Being in the trenches means you have to take immediate action when a child with EAL arrives in your classroom. If you don't, you risk that child not feeling safe enough to learn in school. So in this video, I will showcase three great EAL resources just to get you up and running. So great EAL resource number one is Twinkle. What makes this great is the amount of printable images it has. Images are a universal language. We all understand what to do if someone looks at us and points to an image of a person sitting down, standing up or lining up, etc. Do not underestimate the power of images to the child in the room who does not speak English. Now, I've heard quite a bit of negativity lately about Twinkle, with TA saying that their schools do not want them to use Twinkle resources but I believe this is when Twinkle resources are used in a lazy way, like just printing out a resource and just giving it to a child. Because like any tool, Twinkle is only as good as the person using it. Great EAL resource number two, a brilliant interview with Beth Southern, a specialist leader of education for EAL. She has taught in both primary and secondary schools. And what makes this great is the fact that it's one teacher and one former teacher talking about the challenges of having a child or children with EAL in the classroom. And Beth gives some great expert advice. Now the video is over an hour long, so watch or listen in sections if you don't have time to take it all in at once and definitely come back to it again and again. There's some brilliant golden nuggets in it. And sometimes you don't pick them up and, until you've watched it maybe two or three times because there's so many. Great EAL resource number three is my TA in Control EAL workbook. What makes this great is that it gives you 30 practical steps you can quickly and easily take action on for a child with EAL. So they're there for you. You don't have to think about them. I've, I've given you the practical steps. Each page gives you space to write down how you will go about each step for a child you are working with. The steps are repeated in the second half of the book so that you can either use them again for the same child, but in a different way because that child has now made progress, or you can just use them for a different child. So I hope this video enables you to engage with the subject of EAL because with recent world events and because of families seeking better lives, we need to engage with EAL. The need to engage with EAL is only going to get greater. 
If you'd like to see all 10 of the great EAL resources I found for you, and if you'd like to know more about my TA in Control EAL workbook, you will find links to both in the description section below this video. Here's how to get to the description section if you're not sure. On your phone, tap on the little V under the video to expand the description section. On your laptop, click on show more to expand the description section. Have a good look at the screenshots. When you change your focus from how big a subject is and just get started, that is when progress is made for the children you work with and you become a TA working at your most confident best, a TA in control. Share this video and my resources with your TA colleagues. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed my video.